Hello peeps, it's CG Click 101 here, and today we are here for part four, hopefully it's the final part, of the doll, the doll bedding set tutorial. So today, we're, so now we're going to make the, make the throw pillow! Woo! Wee! I actually, okay, so, um, we're actually going to be using this fabric because this froggy fabric, which is oh so cute, this is all I have left of it, and it is not enough. If I had another square of this, I might be able to pull something together, but this is not enough fabric. Because it was only a remnant, so... Yeah. Anyways, I still have not stuffed my pillow. I will hopefully do that. Oh my gosh, there are ends everywhere. How disturbing. Anyways, so... My throw pillow is three inches by three inches, and because of the seams, it's a bit small, er, but, yeah, so I'm just going to measure out, so I'm going to measure out, oh, sorry, shaking it, shaking it, measure out three inches, okay, I'm going to actually snip it right there, there's a little marker, and then, oh, and then three inches, which is right about here. Okie dokie. Oh, wait. No, I just need to... Okay. Anyways. Yeah, so I hope you have been following this. I hope that everybody... How this... I hope this turns out good for everybody. Anyways, and then, uh... Oh, yeah, we can make our adult throw pillow. That loop. Okay. Anyway, so here we have our fabric, and because I folded it to get it into two pieces, cut that. Ta da! Maybe whenever I like get a good camera or something, I might I might redo this tutorial in a few years and see how much I've improved. Anyway, so now we have our two pieces of fabric. Now just flip them over right side, to, er, right side together, so the wrong sides are facing out, and then you want to use some pins, so, yes, there was a pin on my floor, that's disturbing, I know. Anyways, so I'm actually going to go ahead and take you to the sewing machine, where I will then pin my back. So. <laughs> Here we are again. Whew! Okay. Alright, it's been a long time. So, anyways. So, now I'm actually going to fabric. I'm trying to do this so you can guys, like, you can, so you can, like, see and copy me. Anyways. So, yeah. I hope you guys are all following this. Blah, blah, blah. Um. Anyways. I hope I'm explaining this well enough. I hope I hope. On Interstar U, I actually did find that, for those of you Interstar U users, I'm just going to talk while I'm pinning this. I am doing it. Um. They have the pretty in pink outfit on Interstar U now, so yay! Um. You have to save up stars. It's like, um, I think it's the same price as every other outfit, $495. Or er, not, not that. Okay, forget what I said, it's 495 stars. Stars. <laughs> not dollars, stars. If anybody says that it's, okay. Just don't. Okay. <laughs> Anyways. So, yeah, I'm probably using too many pens on this for the amount of pens I actually go over or something. Anyways, whoop de doo, whoop de doo, and um, if you guys have already seen the other parts, I I do I will be having a playlist. It's probably not it is not up right now, but it should be up a couple of minutes after this video. I just have to um, get all the links, link all the videos together, and then get the playlist together. Which it it won't be too hard. It's just a bunch of going on the webernet and all that. Anyways, so now I have my pinned thing. I left an entire side open, and now I can just use this pin. Just have 
one pin right there, and then where is my other? Okay. Yeah. Mm. Awkward angles. Oh, there it is. Ha ha ha. Yeah, don't actually do that in real life. Do not do anything like that in real life. That was in virtual. Anyway, so now I have my entire thing. See, I just pinned this, and now, like, I'm gonna have to take this out because I hate going over pins. Anyways, so yeah. Oh, that is way too fast for me. Okie dokie. Anyways. I, I started on the... Okay, when I say I started on the wrong side, I mean that I want to start... Okay, so it's like a square, you know? Like, uh, it's like, uh, 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 right? Well, I want to start on this side so I can just so, 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 and then do the opening part. But I always don't... I always forget about that. Anyway, so... Oh, yeah, I can take it any lot. This is the hardest one, probably, because you have to back stitch and stitch and all that. But it's all tiny, so. Oh, great. Did my sewing machine mess up? Please don't say. Don't say it messed up. Right when I need it. Mess up after the video. Come on. Oh, okay. It was just some extra thread. I'll deal with that later. Anyways, then, okay, I don't know. And now we just do the last side. Whoa. Okay. Now, your project should be finished. In a couple of months, I might redo this whenever I'm a better seam sewer person thing. And now I have this. So, let's go back to the floor. Anyway, okay. So, we now have this. And so mine actually got my sewing machine sort of jacked up a little bit, so I'm just gonna snip some threads, snip some threads. Anyway, so, um, you know, okay, while I'm doing the snipping, you just snip that, and then snip that on the other side too. Anyways, so I may actually be able to get a blog, not soon, not anytime soon, but probably before the end of this year, uh, if I can put the work into it, might be able to get a blog, or blah, a blog, I do way too many vlogs. Anyways, so now you have your thingy, you just want to turn it inside out, oh gosh, this is, I made the hole too tiny, no, this is going to take forever. If you make the hole too tiny, don't worry, just, um, keep pushing through it, um, not too hard, but still, if you make the hole really tiny, that's okay, you're just gonna have to push and work it, anyways, so, you guys can see me here, this, this pill is probably gonna be tiny, oh my gosh, this is way tinier than I expected, this is not turning out the way I planned it to be, anyways, okay, one corner done, the other corner, oh my gosh, what? I did not cut enough fabric. Okay, so please make your fabric cuts way bigger than 3x3 three three inches. <laughs> Otherwise, you'll end up with this tiny pillow. I mean, it's not really that much bigger or smaller, but I kind of like this one better. I don't know. Anyways, just cut bigger pieces of material. Anyways, oh, I gotta... Okay, I'm gonna have to finish this up soon. Okay, so you now have this, and 
Now, be sure to just either slip stitch it if you know how to do that, or whip stitch it after you stuff it. So, you can stuff it with anything. You know, I have fabric scraps, but... Anyways. I'm not going to stuff it on video, though, because I don't have any fiber fill with me right now. But, yeah, so that is how you make your doll bedding set. If you have any questions, you can leave them in the comments below. I would be happy, happy to answer them. I am always happy to reply to comments. Anyways, and, yeah. So, there will be a playlist. As soon as I get this video up, I'm going to go to my other YouTube tab and get all the links and all stuff. So, yeah, thanks for watching, I hope you have enjoyed, and now we will model what our doll looks like, at least with the blanket. Um, anyways, let's just put Emily up right here. So, yeah, now you can make your own little doll blanket. So, yeah, I hope this helped. Any questions, leave them in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Comment, rate, like, and subscribe, all that stuff. Bye!